Okay, I thought I'd just squeeze in some uh, time to record this uh, strumming thing very quickly. Um, it's hard to kind of like describe how you strum or how I strum. Uh, like, if there is there a fixed pattern to practice? So I just figured I might as well just play something and then uh, break down from there and then hopefully you can, you know, pick something up from it and that will improve your strumming. So, you know, here we go. Talk so much also no use, right? <laughs> So uh, let's say if I usually how I practice is this uh, if I'm at home. Okay, this this is just one of the exercises that you can probably incorporate into your playing. Now, if you're interested to know the chords that I'm using, is just basically a D two, which is just a I'm just holding two 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 strings. Huh? I'm holding the A. And the D, okay, it's a D chord but without the F sharp, so you get a very open kind of sound. So I'm just strumming, like, and when I'm striking the strings, I'm striking from the D string, okay. Sometimes from with the A, you hear that? It's a big, big difference. This is from the D. This is with the A. Never with the E. Ah, this is ew. just. So the, the arpeggio or the you know the the walk down is basically a C and a B and an A. Okay, I'm just using one finger only to press C. So it's a three string thing. So I'm pressing like let's say here. Okay, and then the G. So it's a. Dun -dun 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 So you can, uh, if I were to break it down, it's a triplet. It's a triplet, 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 and uh, triplet to E and a uh, then four. Okay. So let's try again. This simple thing that you can try at home. Uh, maybe I do it slower. Three, four, and one, two, three. Do it fast. Not too fast. It sounds crappy. Okay, so that's the that's the idea. And then uh, other kinds of strumming patterns, maybe fast one. Uh, recently, I did something. Uh, uh, this uh, Zhang Xuan, uh, I think so, called "Beautiful Woman." So. Uh, It doesn't have to be so busy. I can slow it down. So this is how it looks. Basically, it's a sixteen beat. Uh, uh, the chords I'm using are the same. I'm using a D two, which means I play a D without the. F sharp, but I'm using a G major seven, so a G, and then I have this um, D and an F sharp in it. Okay, and uh, you notice when I was playing, I was like muting it with my left hand. I was just putting my hands around the string, and then you get a chicka chicka sound. So it. These two chords are basically a D2 and then a transit to a D major 7, which I just bring the D down to a C sharp. So you get a D major 7, just two strings here. Okay, so one way to practice this song is just to like um, imagine you're playing the drum, so it's like. I 
actually learned how to strum this uh, listening to a Beatles song called We Can Work It Out. So it's a very fast song and it was played by this five band or five man acoustic group called Tesla. So the song goes... <laughs> Something like that. Um, so I, I was just sitting down trying to figure out how the heck do I, how the heck do they play so fast? And I just figured that you know, at the end of the day, it was just doing this motion. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One. And every time when I play a one, I'm on a downstroke. Okay, it is the same uh, with that rhythmic exercise that I that I recorded earlier. Like you know, you're practicing the right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. One, two, three. Four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. This is my right hand. Huh? So that's the, the same idea. Lah. So whenever you're strumming, you know, try to think of, try to lock on to where the one is. And then the more you practice, I think it gets very natural. Okay, so I think I'll just leave this with you now. And uh, it's a very short one so that you can have fun. Because, oh, maybe one last thing is that you can even use it to play like lead, uh, for example. So you can apply the same concept uh, playing songs like that. Okay, have fun. Bye.